Hey, this is Josh with Bass Kickers and Trout Lickers of Utah. Back again to paint some more lures. We got some new lures today that we haven't done before. These just came in the mail today. We're going to do a bunch of rattle traps. Got this yellow or uh, white, excuse me, white based um, larger rattle trap. This one's about the same size, but it um, has three different connection points to the top of the rattle trap that will give you uh, a different level or amount of action based off of where you attach it to so this is really cool i'm really eager to try those out they're pretty good rattles this is a big bigger rattle this is a small rattle um and then these holographic side uh smaller rattle traps not much rattle in those not much noise with that one and then this is a, a new popper that i've never seen before this is it called a zigzag popper and uh, I'm eager to try that. I've, and maybe they're not new to everybody else out there, but I've never heard of them, so <laughs> I'm going to give it a try. I'm imagining that it's going to act kind of like a pencil bait, but with having the popper top uh, or nose to it. So we're going to go ahead and paint all of these a um, natural perch color. So we're going to do a yellow base. This is a, sorry, yellow flash, so it's the iridescent paints. We're going to do the black uh, flash, which is a kind of a transitional paint from black to a gold. And then we're going to do just a little bit of orange flash right under the um, kind of gill plate or mouth area or whatnot. So it's going to be a very simple color scheme, but I've done a lot of different perches, kind of like these ones hanging up here um, that are, you know, the... I don't know what you call those green perch or whatnot and we're going to do uh, more of a yellow perch this time so let's get started okay we're going to go ahead and get started with the yellow we put some yellow it's i think it's yellow i think i added a little gold to it a while back and mixed the whole bottle because i liked it more anyway so this is going to be perfect for what we're trying to do here i'm lazy so i'm going to try to do two at the same time so Alright, we'll throw that on, throw the blow dryer on that. He set it and do a second coat. Okay, here goes the second coat. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay, there we go. We're all finished. Um, other than, you know, putting sealant or epoxy or whatnot on it. But um, this, I think these are amazing. They turned out great. And I did not know that this, uh, to me, this red flash, or that's not what we used, was it? Yeah, sorry. We used this uh, orange flash, and that orange to purple is just perfect for this. I love that. I don't know if you can see that in the camera. But in the light there, as you go in the sun or whatnot, you see the, the purple flash. And that's really cool. I love it. I'm going to use a lot more of this color. But we uh, put the eyeballs on. All of these lures that we got came off of Amazon. Um, if anybody wants links to exactly which ones we got, let me know. I'm happy to share it. They're, they're really actually pretty decent priced. And like this kit came with... Uh, split rings eyeballs uh the two different styles of lures these uh metal ones or whatnot um the sorry the other rattle traps with the three different attachment spots came with eyes as as well i don't recall the descriptions even saying they're going to come with eyes most of the time it seems like the ones i bought don't come with eye uh, stickers or whatever you call them but anyway so i think um we're going to get these epoxied and we're going to take these out fishing hopefully this week. I've got some vacation plans so we'll see what we can catch and stay tuned for future videos of that coming out. Thanks for watching. <laughs>